Hi, this is Ari Shapiro. Uh, I'm going to show you our new auto rigging and reshaping tool. Uh, this is a project from Andrew Fang out of the USC Institute for Creative Technology from the Character Animation Simulation Group. And what this tool does is it automatically rigs and skins a 3D scan that you can obtain from uh, Microsoft Connect or Acceptable Structure Sensor or a scanning cage or however you generate your 3D model. And what we're doing is we're finding a correspondence between the scan and a set of models that we um, use, that we already rig and skin. And once we find that correspondence, correspondence you can see it happening right there. Um, we then transfer that skinning information onto the mesh. So now you can see the bone placement. The skinning information is colored. Um, and we can start to animate the character to see how uh, good the quality of our, uh, our rigging is. Um, the rig that we're using is a rig that we use internally with our uh, smart body system. If you wanted to, you could rig your own model with your own topology and your own uh, skin weights and um, uh, bones and bone names, and you can use this tool to rig your character the way you want to do as well. The uh, other nice uh, capability that this tool has is that we've parameterized the, the database of models um, along different parameters. So, um, if you look on the right hand side, you see this reshaping set of sliders which gives you height, weight, chest, waist, leg length, and arm length. And by adjusting those sliders, you not only change that particular characteristic, but all of the other characteristics that those models have um, that include that parameterization. So for example, if you want to change the weight, the weight is a, a global parameter. If you want to change the chest, you can see the chest gets bigger, but the legs get a little bit bigger. The uh, shoulders go up a bit. Um, the waist is somewhat interesting. You can see that if you make the waist bigger, you get this sort of fatter appearance, but you can also see that the legs get skinnier, the shoulders get hunched back a little bit, and you get this kind of global effect of what it's like when somebody has a bigger waist. So I think this presents some interesting uh, possibilities uh, for uh, modifying a person's scan. Um, and finally, you can save out the mesh to Colada, um, and um, so this should be a nice tool for, to make the pipeline uh, a bit easier. Thanks.